What's going on? Ladies, let's launch. All right, that's the workout for today. We're gonna be hitting legs, and then we got a monster set. Once our leg set is over, okay, it will be legs as well. And then we'll finish with a five minute little finisher. All right, it's gonna be a great workout. You're gonna be sweating. Make sure you have your waters close. All right, I don't want you to be uh, thinking that you can't rest, right? I don't want you to be thinking that grabbing your water is uh, shameful, right? Have your water near. The goal is always push until you can and rest until you can. All right, so at any time you need to rest, even if I'm not resting, please take that rest. All right, as far as equipment today, you're going to need a chair, all right? Something that you trust when you go and step up on it. Right, so I'm using this right here. I'm all about making things work, queens. All right, we make it work. So I'm here, right? I can trust that I can put my whole body weight up on here and it's gonna hold me up. Well, for now, who knows? I should, probably shouldn't trust it too much. All right, so whatever that you have, if you have a bench, right? If you're in a gym and there's a pile box, use it or use that bench or a chair, all right? Or even a little step stool if you have it, right? If you have, your kid has a little step stool and it's sturdy enough, use that as well. If you do not have a chair and you're a beginner, don't even worry about it, all right? I'll give you a modification when it comes to the step ups and our hip thrusts. All right, sounds good. We're gonna jump right into our warm up and we're gonna get this party started, all right? This is a timed workout, but your time, right? So if you have a stop clock or maybe go ahead if you're on your laptop or on your phone, right? Open up that timer. I want you to time yourself, all right? So as soon as we're about to start, I want you to hit play and let that timer run until you're done, right? And then you're gonna stop it right before this cool down. I wanna see how quick you can get this workout done, all right? Again, this is your pace at your own pace. Don't, you're, you're not against anyone, right? It's always you versus you, queen. Sounds good? All right, baby, we're gonna crush this workout. Here we go, starting with the warm up. Are you ready? Good, give me a little dance move before we start. Ooh, what do you got? Brush your shoulders up. Ooh, shake your hips. <laughs> Alright, ready now? Let's get it queen in three, two, one. Starting with those butt kicks. You're flicking those hips back to your booty. Good. Squeeze those glutes nice and strong. Relaxing those quads. Getting them ready to squat today. Here we go. Stay here with me. In through your nose. Out through your mouth. Start that breathing up right here, right now. Come on, we're gonna crush this workout. Let's go. Good. In three, two, and one, good, out to the front, some kicks, pointing those toes up by your face. I wanna stretch out the back of the legs here. Good, squeeze the belly tight, keep it strong. Good, if you're beginning, I'll be throwing out modifications, please feel free to take them. Three, two, and one. All right, let's activate those quads now. Feet shoulder distance apart, you're sitting back and down, into that squat. So there's a chair behind you. I want you to tap that chair, drive it right up. Keeping those heels on the ground. Good, let's go for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, come on. Four, three, two, and one. Beautiful job. We're gonna split those feet up. Getting ready to lunge today, right? Ladies, let's lunge. Here you go. Split your feet up. Nice, proud chest. Shoulders and hips right on top of each other. I want you to drop that back knee down. Drive through that front heel. All right, you got about 80% on this front leg. About 20 back here. All right, so most of that weight is in that front leg. Let's go. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Good. Two. And one. Go ahead and switch it out. Same thing. Nice proud chest. Give me a nice little pelvic tuck here. Squeeze that back glute on. 80% in the front. 20 behind you. Good. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Beautiful. Stay with me. Nine and ten. Well done. We're going to hurry up a little bit here with some high knees. If you need to march, go ahead and march it out. Let's go. Good, stay with me now. Raise that heart rate up a little bit. Good, give me 10, nine, eight, seven, come on, let's go. Good, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, pelvic tuck, squeeze the booty and hips forward, belly button back towards that spine. I want you to turn 
and twist. Good. Stay with me now. Come on. In through your nose, out through your mouth. Well done. Good. Three, two, one. Good. Up and over now. Three, two, one. Beautiful. Drop that knee down. Good. All right, I want you to come down. Hands right by those feet. Good. Back leg either stays on the ground or tuck your back toe on underneath. Raise that knee off the ground. Good. If you feel your glute, it should be tight. Turn it on. Beautiful. We're opening up the hips here. Stretching it out. Drop that knee down if you need to and switch just like this. Okay? Leave it here or tuck up that toe and raise it up. Okay? Nice deep breaths. Beautiful. All right, you can drop the back knee down and switch or you can stay up here, look back and switch. Look back and switch. Good. Stay with me now. Come on. Good. One more each side. Beautiful. Back to plank. Walk those hands up by the feet. Good. Stay down here with me for three, two, one. Rise it up. Good. Feet underneath the hips. Last one here. Squeeze those glutes. Bring the hips back. Squeeze the glutes forward. Good. Everything's coming from the hips. The hips bring you back. The hips bring you forward. Good. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. All right. Warm up is done. You're going to go right into it. All right. Our first superset. We have alternating reverse lunges. So dumbbells are going to be at your side. Stand up nice and tall. You're going to bring that back leg back. Drop it back knee down. Drive to the front foot. And then you're going to switch. Right, left, right, left. We're going to hit 10. From 10, you're bringing that chair in, your bench, your pile box, whatever you got. All right, you're going to lay it flat on your back. You're going to dig your heels. I want your toes facing forward. Dig the heels. Toes facing upward, yeah? From here, you're going to bring the lower back on the ground by squeezing your belly button down, tucking your glutes underneath you. From here, squeeze the glutes and rise your hips up as high as you can. Keep the glutes tight and bring it down. All right, as you leave the ground, your hips leave the ground first, your back, Lower back and hips come down. All right, so opposite. So your hips, then your lower back, then I want your lower back and your hips to finish. All right, we have 10 here with dumbbells or a barbell, whatever you have on your hips. You've got 10. Here's the deal. You're at your own pace, right? So that means you're going to be doing four rounds at your own pace. Pushing until you can and resting until you can. Once your four rounds are up, I'll, I'll give you like 20 seconds to finish. If you're still going, then continue. But in that 30 seconds, we're gonna start our monster set. All right, so right now, I just want you worrying about alternating reverse lunge and your hip thrust. 10 and 10 each at your own pace, at your own rhythm. Pushing your weights here, yes? Medium, moderate weight. Are we ready to crush this? Yes, give yourself some space, grab those dumbbells. Here we go. If you're timing yourself and you want to try to get a good time, right, so you can continue on every single week and try to beat yourself, start your timer off right now. Start it. Good. All right. Now join us in three, two, start round one. Shoulders and hips are stacked up. Step it back. Drop that lower back and get that knee down. Stand up through the front leg. That's two. That's three. So try to stay with me the best you can. Four, five, six. Inhale, exhale. Seven, good. Eight, nice proud chest. Nine, and ten. Beautifully done. Now, bring that chair in. Lay down flat on your back. Dig the heels into that surface. Make sure you're at a 90 degree angle here. Okay? From there. Grabbing one dumbbell or two, up to you. 
You're gonna drive those hips up nice and tall. So squeeze those cheeks right here. Raise it up. Good, that's one. Two, three, four. Good, five, nice. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good, that is round one. If you need to rest, take your rest. If you're ready to go, round two. All right, come on baby, let's push. Two, three, good. Four, come on. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Beautiful job, finish out those 10. Good, keep working ladies, that's the way to push. That's the way to rest if you're resting. Come on, keep it up. If you're ready to add a second dumbbell, I like to stack them up. All right, so I'll stack them up, hold them nice and tight on my thighs, not my hip bones. Good, bring those heels in, get ready to rock. Here we go, 10, nine, eight, Seven, six, come on. Five, four, three, two, come on, last one. One, well done. Throw those hips off your dumbbells off to the side. Don't throw your hips unless you want to shake them. And you can shake those hips, girl. Go for it. All right, round three. That's the way to push, that's the way to rest. Come on, queens. Round three, here we go. If you're ready with me, let me push you. Let me take you through. Let's get it. One, two, three, four, come on, five, six, seven, eight. Beautiful. Nine, last one, ten. Well done. I need you to stay pushing here now. All right, heart rate's up. Take your rest if you need to. If you've got that push, keep pushing. I'm gonna stack my dumbbells up a little bit easier this way. I know, you probably noticed that too. Woo, lay it flat, heels come up. Good, make sure your feet are not too far away from you. You wanna be a little bit closer. And when you're ready, squeeze those glutes from the bottom. Don't wait to the top. I want you squeezing from the bottom. Good. That's how you raise those hips up. Don't just raise the hips. Squeeze your glutes, right? Like you have a hundred dollar bill on a windy day in between those glutes and you don't want to lose it, right? You work hard for it. Come on. Four, five, six, seven. Come on, push. Eight. Nine, woo, and 10, good. If you're using no chair, your feet are on the ground. All right, that would be your modification, sorry about that. All right, so feet on the ground, raising your hips up, digging the heels into the floor. All right, with the feet elevated, it's gonna ask a lot more from your hamstrings, and if you're doing them with me, I know you feel that, right? Right, all right, ladies. Round four, are you ready? This is it, right here. Woo! Come on, buddy. Let's work. Good, nice proud chest. One, hold the dumbbells by your side. Keep the shoulders back. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's it. Last one right here. Finish strong. Finish with purpose. Finish with intentions. Good. Woo! Come on, baby. Let's do it. All right. Squeeze those glutes from the bottom. Rib cage and belly button. Stay down. Let's go for 10. Nine. Woo! 
seven, six, five, four, three, come on, two, one, well done, well done, if you're finishing up, go ahead and finish up, all right, everyone else, if you finish your four rounds, you are getting a drink right now, you are resting, Woo! you are walking around the room, no sitting, breathe, inhale, exhale, well done queens, we got this, all right, you're finishing up now, well done, walk around, grab a drink, breathe, catch your breath, all right, here we go, you ready for this monster set, here's what's happening, your first move, step ups. I want to make sure that entire foot is on the surface of whatever you're using. The bench, the chair, the pile box. Do not just let your heel be here. Because then if you step up, what's going to happen? Woo! All right, so make sure that entire foot gets up on that box and you're only using that top leg. So don't come here and then use the bottom leg to help you. Right, so you're here, drive all the way up. That opposite foot, I just smacked my butt, it's fine. <laughs> you can do it too. All right, the opposite foot is not helping you. It doesn't even need to touch the surface of the chair or bench or pile box. We're gonna do 10 on the right, 10 on the left. From there, we're gonna go Bulgarian split squats. What those look like? All right, I like to use a mat here to add some height. You don't want it to be too low. All right, if you don't have that chair, then you're gonna be here. Right, and for the step up, if you don't have a chair, then you're gonna be giving me forward lunges this time. We just did reverse, I want you to do forward. And then the, for the Bulgarian foot squats, you're here, right? Pop that foot up on that chair, you're gonna drop that back knee down, drive it up, making sure this knee is not all the way over that toe. All right, I want the heel on the ground, knee should end directly above that toe, and then you're driving through that front leg. Again, 20% back here, about 80% up here. All right, so we're really focusing on that front leg. We're gonna go 10 on the right, 10 on the left. From there, drop your dumbbells, no weight. You're gonna go for jump squats. Sit down low, jump it up tall, land right back in that squat. If you need to modify, you're staying down low, and I want you to pulse for 15 reps. Woo! It doesn't matter if you're jumping or not, you're still gonna be working hard. Yes? All right, queens, are we ready for this monster set? Same thing follows. You have four rounds at your own pace. Once those four rounds are up, you are done. You are waiting for me to start your, your five-minute finisher. All right? Big deep breath. Starting with step-ups. Use some weights that challenge you, queen. I want to see you challenge yourself. It should be tough. You should be huffing and puffing. You should be forced to take that rest. All right? Here we go. Let's do it. Full foot up on that surface. Good. Do not use that opposite leg. Squeeze the heel into the ground. Drive up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. If you're modifying, you're giving me forward lunges. So you're taking a big step forward, dropping the back and down, driving straight back up. 10 on the right, 10 on the left. All right, switch it up when you're ready. Here we go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wonderful job. Drop your dumbbells. If your surface is too low, add a foam roller or a mat, roll it up and put it on top. All right? If you're modifying, your foot stays on the ground, you're dropping it back and down, you're driving it up, just like we did in the warm up. Same thing here. 10 on the right, 10 on the left, baby. Let's go. When you're ready, yeah? Good, when you're ready, go for it. Well done, ladies. 
keep working hard. Woo. Find that balance. Fix that foot. Good. Bulgarian split squats. Good. I'm grabbing my foam roller. It just makes it so much easier because the foam roller moves naturally, right? So as I come down and my leg has to adjust, it'll adjust for me. Woo! All right, baby girl. Let's go. You got it? Hell yeah, you got it. Come on. Good, get that foot set up and work. Oh, 
Let's do it. Good. Stay with me now. Come on. Bulgarian split squats are on the menu. Right? <laughs> I know. 
Once you have it, you just gotta push to 10. Good. 
get out of your mind. Get into your body. Come on. Feel how strong you are. Two more. Two more. You got this. Two more. Let's go. Finish line is in sight. Feel it. You can see it. Just move. It's that last mile of the marathon, baby. We gotta push now. One more. One more. How are you showing up today? Don't give up. You're there. Last five. Come on. Good. Good. Bring both knees 
down, tuck the toes, lift those hips off the ground, reach the chest back towards the thighs, walk those heels into the ground, left, right, good, and walk the feet up towards the hands, okay, bend the knees, let your belly hang over your thighs, grab the elbows, tuck the chin, and just breathe. Good, lift it up one vertebrae at a time. Your head should be the last thing up. Beautiful. Good, roll those shoulders back. Four, three, two, one. And time. Ladies, left, one. Well done today. Give me some. Woo! All right, take a left hand, take that right hand. Give yourself a round of applause. Good, be proud of yourself for finishing that workout. Be proud of yourself for showing up, all right? Don't be too hard on yourself. You have room to improve. This is only week one, all right? So don't be discouraged. Keep showing up and keep giving me 1% better every single day, all right? That's the goal, 1% stronger than yesterday. And you are now that, all right? So well done, be proud of yourself. All right, ladies, this is it for today. Okay, like I always leave you, it is a beautiful day to feel empowered. Go out and make the most of it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. I love you. Mwah. Woo -woo -woo.